couple are confounded beneath fronds of surgical light, ruthless LED, making this minute island. Nurses and the obstetricians wait busily as the father surreptitiously sucks the nitrous oxide. She is shipwrecked despite the plans and training. Push, breathe, breathe, get this fucking thing out of me and not a ripple of response from anyone except the partner who dabs at her brow with a damp cloth as though he's tamping down grass fires on this atoll's interior. Lapping the shores are the heart waves of two beings, mother and fetus. Statistical narratives are noted down by the clerical energies of medicine. 18 hours and counting the indignity of miracles, the atrocity. There's flurry, then cries full of need and living. A new small life on this burnt summer's day. Lorikeets lift from the palms outside. Here the deepest compact is born. A covenant. Both parents worry for the world. But feel sure there'll be space yet. For this tiny, mighty voice. We still look for licorice, McKechnie. After the band broke up, of course she went to America. Could be dead, but almost certainly somewhere west, the tumbleweeds of faith curl the sands. But Lena and I were there, she didn't show. We called across Arroyo's rote in the highway dust. There were only a few coins. Some howled its blues. Hubbubs had been practicing the slide that puke and grit assail the dunes. Like a murder. Nothing works. Love is this real, wind is a wheel, fish came back to an empty river, money fled the scene, and fame was rubbish on the canyon rim. Our hungry cars chewed on beetles, hopes went to shade and assumed a passive menace. We couldn't approach a most likely hangout. The laneway was too damaged. Perhaps licorice had the clock's dementia. Arizona does that to any mild holiness. So much smoke for just a few coughs of poetry. Our irrelevance is durable but effortless to maintain. Freedom is actually free but hazardous. An email came from Joshua Tree, California. Nothing works, love is real, wind is a wheel, fish came back to an empty river, money fled the scene, and fame was rubbish on the canyon rim. Back roads were renamed after decades, or abandoned, overgrown. Joan is still busy, Jance has gone, and Martin. Sting has a vineyard in Tuscany, Arlo votes Republican. Once hitched across the country for the festivals, the bands, now a laser plays the small songs from the palm lines of my hands. What if it was all about messing with the head? We still chase visions and excuses, then tour inside. Nothing works. 
love is this real wind is a wheel fish came back to an empty river money fled the sea and fame was rubbish on a canyon rim for myself I try to put out a collector's item every three years more feathers come in than royalties I have no complaints while I search for licorice McKechnie. The surgeons wanted to cut them out, but the girl had other ideas, albeit half formed, like those lumps on her shoulder. Scans were inconclusive, but the medical profession poked, prodded to a point where bruises blossomed across her back. There were suggestions of surgery. Could leave a tattoo of suffering across her adult life, all within acceptable boundaries drawn by those without affliction. As the skin began to split around, the urgencies of her scapulae, doctors sought orders from the court. Her parents took the family on an extended holiday. Process servers fretted about the vacated home, but all the neighbours refused to answer questions. Common good, common purpose. Emily's wings required adaptation, but she thrived above the clods of debate, that aggregate of rules, those endless line markers at their bitumen, her party dress of clouds now skims the globe. Like a currawong's wing combing tangles of air or the pulse of water skin on this sated lake. Ah, let me be lazy. Beside the bat squeal shift pitch fruits of a roosting tree, twigs accrete by the hand span brook, a minute dam of tadpole consequence. White cockatoos weed grumble, we cannot ask for still, so let me be lazy. Stock markets crumple them saw, money gibbers around the globe, roads stretch to fit our waistline as soldiers camp on contended land. The Cyrillic of white on the black swan's wing is no battle plan for any general, but my eyes are indolent. Those paths won't crack the world. A cranky call from the water hen to planes overhead, then I am back amongst gesticulated arguments still based in the caves. We need more, they want ours, greed and fear again. Willows trawl the lake, eels archive the histories of mud. Time to replace the tribal gods, they've started and won every war. The peoples of the book should throw those books away. There comes a time when blood outweighs the ink. So let me be lazy. I have painted all the pretty specks done the overstand, then the understand without illuminance or audience. My father is dead, let the wet cold tortoises mind the plinth, we'll sing our hymns to fish. A seagull is whisking a cloud in the shallows, your sleep is disturbed, your lunch, what surrounds us is not serene, crows are singing little lamb, each weed is a contest, but it's the violence of the blinking eye, hum of the skin, so let me be lazy. Chain each man of power to weathered wooden benches until 
the infusion of bird calls subdues their hands. Immobilized eyelids will surrender to a day of casual forage. It's simplistic to say, simplistic to deny. We need peacekeepers to patrol our heads with lazy as our prayer, train ourselves to say enough. Intelligence will listen as each day becomes its own statement of